So I asked Instagram because Carter is so bored, should I let him open up a gift? And they said, yeah. So I'm gonna let Carter open up one Christmas gift. FMAK is the squad. Got our mommy going hard. We love our father, we love God. Can't believe we made it this far. We, we, we on YouTube going hard. Can't nobody judge us for God. Can't nobody judge us for God. Can't nobody judge us for God. FMAK is the squad. You want to open up one? Go ahead. Open it. Look, this one's down here. Yeah. What'd you get? You have to take off all of it. Take it off. Mm -hmm. What was that? It's a dinosaur? like it so i have the kids organizing their clothing i'm tired of seeing clothes everywhere so we're gonna have night clothes shirts and outside pants and if you are wondering where i got these organizers from the link will be directly down in the description box below it is from amazon and it's a space saver because y'all know i live in a walk-in closet so let's see what these kids get done because i can't with these clothes all over the place i'm tired I can't take it. These clothes, and we have like a ton of laundry bags, and we're gonna see how we can condense them. Let's. So we done. have everything packed. I listened to cousin in the room. Each girl has one. Honey, I'm exhausted. Okay, we did a lot of donation clothes, and this is the keeps, and we are done. Floor clear. I gotta sweep. Floor clear. Listen, Cairo took all my balls off my poor little tree. See all those still there? All those gone um that's it these oh if you are interested in these bags they come in super super handy i'll leave the link just directly down below i got them off amazon so right now we're just doing some cleaning we got michaela cleaning out the linen closet she's looking lost i don't understand all she's supposed to be doing was folding and placing right we have Alyssa cleaning out the refrigerator she's the best refrigerator cleaner and faith is back there cleaning up her room and i am over here still doing this hopefully we'll be done in 2022 honestly it's so much fucking ice out here that this this is why i didn't want to come outside but i had to walk to the supermarket if i fall i can't get back up so what's gonna happen and i don't got time to be laid out out here be mindful how well I'm walking, please. Sir, can you help me? Because I ain't got time. Honestly, this don't make no sense. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. I ain't got time. So we are back from outside walking to the supermarket. It is overly retarded, crazy, stupid, nasty outside. I don't know. Kai should keep texting me, but anyway. Um it is crazy outside. It absolutely doesn't what the fuck? They shooting. 
Oh, not they shooting. Black people will text you and then won't pick up their phone. She talking about they shooting. They shooting where? And why are you there? Hello? Hello? What you mean you can't get out the store? You better get the hell out of there. They not letting people out. I will be like, miss, you gotta let me out this fucking store. Don't lock me in no fucking store. I'll go crazy. See, I'm going crazy. I can't calm down. Put her on the phone. I'll be like, get my fucking wife out that fucking store. Why you want to walk out here? I know I had no choice. I didn't try. He tried to hit me with a beer bottle. It's over there. That's when you can't be calling the cops. I don't want to call the cops. Make sure you need to take somebody for the cops. This is crazy. Honestly, Kaisha just scared the shit out of me. I thought she said they were shooting in Dollar Tree that she was in. But she said they was fighting. And the person said they're about to shoot. And that's like Brooklyn terms for like shoot the hands. <laughs> Bitch, no, I thought they were shooting. What's going on? <laughs> so I told her, she's like, oh, I should go to another Dollar Tree. No, you should not. If that ain't the sign to come home, no. You should not go to another Dollar Tree. Honestly, y'all, I cannot. What the? It's too much for me. But anyway, it is disgusting outside. Clearly, people are losing their goddamn minds. To be very, very honest with you guys, I haven't been feeling like myself. I've been a little off. And it's just not normal. And for these last, like two weeks <laughs> wait a minute for these last like two weeks i've been telling y'all like i'm exhausted and every time i vlog i'm telling y'all like now my hair is falling out and my chest is hurting like at some point i have to realize that something is really wrong like with the excessive weight gain like it's just so much going wrong with me and i'm just like oh no it's because of this and it's because of this. and kaisha just keep telling me go to the doctor go to the doctor go to the doctor get a full blood culture but i'm like i literally just got one six months ago i don't want to go again but i'm gonna go monday today's sunday today's saturday today's saturday i'm going to go get a whole full blood culture and see what's going on um i don't i feel like i don't have the best doctor like he wants you to diagnose yourself so when you go in and you tell him your concerns he's like oh maybe it could be this and maybe how about you find out how about you stop guessing you take blood work so i just really need you guys advice and i need a favor i'm not good at this stuff i'm gonna be honest i'm not good with going to a regular pcp all my life i just only cared about going to my gyn my heart and my head never mattered it was always about my my wop as long as it was a-okay go to the gyn every six months it won't ever take blood work so i'm not i'm not even gonna lie but i do need you guys help with this one thing if you can just go to the comic section below and like tell me some things that i should be asking the doctor right now my concerns are the excessive weight gain my hair is falling out in patches i'm always like exhausted and i'm just really telling y'all run down that everything was wrong with me like my chest has been killing me my cheeks has been like bloodshot red and burning like i'm 
I'm just not feeling well. I'm not feeling like myself. So if there's anything that y'all can think of that I should ask them to probably like really look into this area or really check me for this. Or I know the whole thyroid thing I'm going to ask about. I'm going to ask about my cholesterol. I'm going to ask about my blood pressure. But if there's anything else that y'all think I should ask him, please leave down below. Because this man is whatless. He is going to be like, so what do you think is wrong with you? I think that's why I'm here for you to tell me. So I just want to go in there with a whole book and I want to be like, listen, check me for this. Do a full blood work, but specifically look into this area. Make sure you do a lot of blood for this and check this. And I want to know about that. And I want so like, I need to know what's wrong with me. Even if it's just like, bitch, you need a drink. Tell me I need a drink. I don't know what's wrong with me. Um, I am about to get caught already and my nieces and my nephew is up here from Utica. I'm excited they get to come over girl. As you can see earlier I already had a house full and I'm about to go get them. It's about to be amazing. Of course I'm going to vlog that and of course you guys is going to see that tomorrow. I'm excited about that. Honestly I just feel weak just being on camera right now like I feel like I just need to lay down for 10 minutes. Just 10 minutes. Like, I'm, I, maybe it's because I'm always on the go. Like, I don't stop. And you know what's crazy? It's so much stuff that y'all don't see. It's genuinely because I can't even pick up the camera to record it. Like, I'm cleaning up 50 times a day. I'm chasing after the kids. I'm cooking. I'm cleaning. And it's a constant all day, all day, all day. And then I'm up all night. And it's just, it's a lot, yo. It's a whole lot. And I'm looking forward for the first time in my life to a doctor's appointment. But right now, I'm going to go get life. What you yelling at? Go get your food. So today, I was thinking of having a TikTok party. Um, Deontay's coming over. Donasia. And uh, Don, little Donnell. Oh, I'm Who else? So, I was thinking if y'all want to have a party, get some liquor, some cigarettes. Mm-hmm. Who smokes cigarettes in here? Not me. Oh, okay. <laughs> she said, she said Carter. So I'm just saying, Carter, you down for a party today? Say train. What's this snow? This dirty snow now. Yeah, it's dirty. Okay, y'all. So Kaisha scared me so bad that I put on some clothes and I came outside with her. And we're trying another Dollar Tree. Hopefully, no one shoots or start fighting. Okay? Because I ain't got time. I'm too big to run. I almost bust my ass right there just now. Look at my beautiful baby. She's so big. You almost fell? Cause I, right. Because I would have put mad effects on it. Look at my baby. I love her. Oh, okay. She's been wanting to be in a rapper all day. Don't know what's going on with the girl. Oh, no. Nothing. I, I ain't got nothing going on. I almost got shot today. That's it. <laughs> what a way to think. Babe, Christmas is coming. Oh. You're not supposed to be with Okay, okay. All right, all right. Fuck no. you. Um, I needed to um get my... So, um, so I wasn't aware that Dollar Tree had Snapples. Mango is my favorite. Also, there's these cookies. And they are oatmeal. And they have some vanilla cream on them. And they hit different. And I don't know the name of them. They usually have them in like Dollar Tree. But they different. Why she play with me all the time? You see how much she play with me? But when I smack that beanie off in Dollar Tree. Honestly. I don't know what they are. But it's the cheap ones that's the best ones. Um, I came to get my kids some snacks. And I'm broke. So I got the snacks from Dollar Tree. I know in my last vlog y'all heard me say I wouldn't suggest the snacks from Dollar Tree. But when you broke you can't really go on suggestions. Okay? There's no such thing. And honestly, they be having, I'm gonna smack the shit out of her. 
they be having name brand stuff. I gotta get my stock and stuff.